Hello and welcome back to RC Model Reviews. It's dark, isn't it? Yes, it's dark because on my bench I have some of those LEDs from was it, RC Timer I spoke to you about. And the two that were most interesting were the white and the orange coloured ones because they use phosphors to create their, their illumination. Uh, by shining an ultraviolet light on the back of phosphors, it re or excites the phosphor and creates a light, a visible light coming out the front. And I've got in my hand here an ultraviolet LED. And it's turned on and I've got the LEDs with the phosphors on them on my bench. And watch what happens here. Well, first of all, I'll, I'll turn on the normal light. Now you can see, ta-da, there we go. Hopefully it'll focus. There we go. There's the RC timer lights. So I've got the white one at the top and the orange one at the bottom. And you see, it looks pretty normal. I'm going to switch to ultraviolet. You watch what happens. Woo, see that? Now, the phosphors are just as bright, but the rest of it's gone really dark, of course, because the phosphors are converting the ultraviolet light into visible light, which the camera picks up really well. So those orange ones especially really stand out. The phosphor, the orange phosphor is excited by this ultraviolet light and re-emitting on the visible wavelength. And same go the white one, see it's it's white, it's not yellow. If I go back to the other light, you see now, you can see the colour of the phosphors. This is regular light. We've got ultraviolet. Woo! See that? There you go. Now, as I say, I just thought I'd pop this video on the channel so you can see how that phosphor stuff works. This ultraviolet's not that ultraviolet, it's got a bit of blue in it, so it's, it could be a shorter wavelength if I really wanted to excite these phosphors, but you can see the principle behind it. It's the ultraviolet light from the LED makes those phosphors glow. Thank you for watching. If you've got questions, comments, put them in the usual place. And now I will get back to my creepy looking bench. Bye for now.